ikiwa kama Tif TV. Tif TV tupo kijamii zaidi. So you need tough leadership. You need to be uncompromising. Uh, you must have a hard skin I must say. Uh, because you know it entails big returns uh, to some uh, but for us really the we have been able to succeed to some extent because number one we focused on uh, strengthening institutions of governance so the control and the auditor general uh, at the very top level, we made sure that uh, his office gets the resources in terms of money, budgetary resources, in terms of personnel, in terms of equipment, to be able to use technology uh, to monitor various uh, uh, transactions. Uh, but then we also had to strengthen the anti-corruption watchdog. Uh, the Prevention of Corruption Bureau. We call it PCCB. Uh, this was very important. That entails also scrutinizing the officers that are placed uh, in those uh, institutions. But we also have uh, the parliamentary watchdogs, the parliamentary accounts committee, and deliberately we decided that the head, the chairperson of this committee, has to come from the main opposition party uh, so that there is no uh, hiding of whatever officials are doing. But we also have uh, uh, the local authorities accounts committee in parliament. And these are very strong committees uh, that has to uh, ensure and keep track of what is actually going on in, in government. We also have another uh, institution which uh, looks uh, at public procurement. It is a regulatory authority. And again, uh, you have to be very careful in terms of who to select to track public procurement mm -hmm. because 70% of government money goes through uh, public procurement mm -hmm. and you need a strong eye there. Mm -hmm. uh, so, but besides, uh, you have individuals uh, including uh, uh, what Madame uh, Helen here said, that you have individuals uh, who mobilize other stakeholders. Yes. So outside government, outside mainstream government, and the example she gave was uh, the former uh, head of the, uh, the, the Control and Auditor General's office who established an independent institution, again, to double check uh, what goes on uh, in the public system and therefore involving other players uh, becomes a central part of uh, the fight against corruption.